much higher memory bandwidth, and a more powerful media engine for blazing performance. With ProRes acceleration coming to the Mini, video editing in Final Cut Pro is over twice as fast. Damn, sounds good, so Mac. excited about the new Mac Mini. Probably can't and afford now, it, it's though. Even more affordable, mm -hmm. starting at just $599. $599. $599. Three days later. Yo guys, welcome back to the video. As you can see from the skit, today we're going to be unboxing the new Mac Mini M2. Only available in one color, the silver. Always been a Windows guy, but let's see how it is. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's get straight into the unboxing. Whoa. Classic Apple logo. I've got the 8GB version. 8GB of RAM, 256 gigabytes of SSD. I'm not going to be doing too much extreme editing and stuff. It's just more for YouTube videos and just for fun and a few school projects here and there. Take a look. Mac Mini. And wow. I like it. Very nice design. Can't go wrong with Apple products. Always have very good designs. Just a simple classic Apple logo. Unveil the ports. Oh, that size, so. Yep, so that's the power button. The Ethernet, I believe. The two Thunderbolts, obviously, if you get the base model of the M2, you only get two Thunderbolt ports the HDMI, two USBs, and a headphone jack. And inside the box, obviously you get the classic Apple. Probably get a sticker, Mac Mini book. Yep, a nice silver sticker, very nice. And obviously the power supply cable. So in the UK, that would have been 649 Great British Pounds. You do pay little. It says Mac Mini let you know it's a Mac Mini. Okay, so we're gonna get to the setup now. Yo guys, I've just received my new Dell 27 inch monitor, beautiful, I think it really goes well with the Mac Mini itself because of the silver colour. I've set up my Mac Mini, I've just added my iCloud, transferred a few things here and there. This video is 4K, uh, 24 FPS and it runs really smooth compared to my old PC which was literally a Windows i5, the M2 chip just handles the speeds really well, even for 8 gigs, it just handles 4K video. No buffering when there's overlays. Yeah, it's amazing. Productivity, whatever you want to do on this computer, I think it's a steal. So if you're planning to buy the $599 base model, workflow and everything is just perfect. No buffering. Overlays working perfectly. If you want to buy it, then I would highly recommend it if it's in your range. And hope you guys just enjoyed the video. Quite short. I just started.